Hello everyone, my name is Brahma and welcome to another Minecraft tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to build the fountain that you see right here. It's going to be a rather short tutorial this time. Uh, as you see it's not that big, but uh, yeah, I just thought this might be useful. Uh, you can use it to just ready up a town square or place it to fancy up your garden, I don't know. But let's get to it. So you can see I laid down a lot of stuff here. I'm going to explain what I did. Um, first off, I'll just say this is the front, just to make it easier. Um, and you want to place three stone slabs like this. Uh, yeah, three. Then one and three, so seven in total. This is going to be the middle. Now you want to count uh, one. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. This is going to be the middle. So let's just mark that this is the middle of the, yeah, of the circle, because we're basically going to make a circle, and then a smaller circle with the fountain. And then from this point, you count again 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So then this is 10, and then 1. Then 10, so 10 plus 10 plus 1, 21 in total. And on this side, you do the exact same, like this. So I'll fly over so you can see if you did the same. And now, as you can see here, I already connected this. You can see it going out 3, then 2, then a little pyramid shape, then 2, then 3. So I'm going to show you how you, yeah, how you do that right here. So uh, we start here, oh, let's start here, we already did this. Uh, you have these seven blocks here. You're gonna go to the end one, right here, and then count one, two, three, like this. I have to quickly take a peek, yeah. Then one, two, then one, two, three. Then what you can do is just fill this in. And to make it easier, you can then start from this side again. One, two, three. One, two. So now you can see three, two, pyramid shape, two, three, and then we go. So I'm gonna do this once more. One, two, three. One, two. One, two, three. One, two. Then we need to connect them by doing this. And there you go. Just quickly taking a look. Uh, I need to fill them in to see if I did the, the right thing here. One, two, three, one, two, one, two. Like that. That is not how you do it. My bad. This one's right, I think. Yeah, this one is not right. My bad. It's if you have one side done, then it's pretty easy to copy. So that's what we are gonna do. I like this. Yeah, sorry, there we go. <laughs> um, so now what you want to do is make this thing. So, just quickly gotta check. One, two, three, four, five. So we want to count. One, two, three, four, five, and place the first one here. It's gonna be three blocks wide. Let's do that on each side. One, two, three, four, five. See, 
One, two, and then on the third block we place them. One, two. It's easier to recognize it that way. So now we've got this. Quickly gotta take a peek. Okay, there we go. You just wanna do this. Have them come out like this. So we have the three blocks and two on the side. Then connect this up. this and connect them. Again this is the line and then connect them. This is the line and then connect them. Like so. Now what you want to do is get polished andesite or no sorry uh, stone slabs and go all around the side of this thing. Also do this. Doesn't really matter. There you go. So now we've got it looking like this. Then what you want to do is get polished andesite and fill the rest of this space up. here or whatever you build it on and just fill this in that's quite easy so yeah there we go Tell right now, <laughs> this is yeah, just filling in the parts that we haven't done yet, so it's not really that much to talk about. I guess I can tell you uh, that, as always, if you have any suggestions for future tutorials for buildings or or anything else that you want me to do or yeah, just leave a comment and I'll always look at them it's yeah, rather easy for me to look at all the comments since there aren't a whole lot <laughs> and now you can do this if you want to you don't have to it's up to you, I just do it because I don't know, just makes it look a bit fancier, I guess. And now we want to build the actual fountain, so for that I'm going to have to take a quick peek in just a second. What we can do already is fill all of this up with dark prismarine. Uh, it makes it look a little bit... Uh, I kind of... How do I say this? It looks to me a bit like cobblestone <coughs> or it could look like cobblestone that just has been underwater I guess that's what they went for with the dark prismarine uh, so yeah I'm gonna have to take a quick look here um, okay there we go so you wanna build up one two three one two three then on the one this one, you want to do this, and then we want to get a water bucket, and just gonna take a quick peek. Yep. Okay, that's it. There we go. 
Oh, I missed one. Work. So now you want to do this. It creates a nice fountain. But it still looks a bit off. So what do we do? We get our cobblestone right here. Then, yeah, okay. I wasn't sure exactly. Um, right here and here. We want to place the cobblestone. Um, yeah, there they are. So here and here. To check if you did this right, you can see that this one uh, is going to dry up because you closed it off from the water. But you can just do this and fill it in again, and then get two cobblestone walls up like this. And then do this, just to give it a bit more detail. Uh, where did I place that? That was dumb. And there you go. Now you can place first marine, or no, sea lanterns, right here. And as you can see, this is all... Uh, yeah. This is an air gap right here. Now, right now, this you can't really see through. So what we're gonna do is get it going like this. That didn't screw up anything. And now you can see through it a bit better. So we want to do that over here as well. we want to get water going all around this because then you can see it way better and there you go I think it's gonna take a quick peek it's been a while since I've built this so my memory is not the best of it yep that's the fountain done I hope you found it useful I hope you can build this and put it to great use uh, so yeah as always that was it for this tutorial and I will see you all next time.